Pete the Sneak here, and welcome back to my channel, everybody. So over the past month, I've been working on a Shining Pearl Nuzlocke, and I realized it's been taking way too long. So I decided just to cut out basically the entire playthrough and just fast forward all the way to the Leaf 4 and the Champion Battle, because that's pretty much all everybody really really cares about so this is a three-part series this part is going to cover our rival battle right before the elite four our battle against bertha and our battle against aaron so that being said please make sure you subscribe to the channel for our nice little three-part series and here's our team all right so let's go through the squad and let's get right into this i mean we're trying to we're trying to do this so we're going to lead off with starfire holding leftovers uh, we have Psychic, Calm Mind, Stealth Rock, and Flash Cannon. We'll be adding in Dazzling Gleam when we head into Cynthia, but for right now, that's going to be the setup. Next up, we have Gengar. So he's running Dark Pulse, Giga Drain, Shadow Ball, and Dazzling Gleam. Don't really care about the attack stat. And he's holding the Spooky Plate, which is going to increase the Ghost-type moves. So uh, Shadow Ball will be my go-to for a little while. Next up, we have my Garchomp, a.k.a. Slump. We got Crunch, Bulldoze, because I couldn't get Earthquake, um, Dragon Claw, and Swords Dance. And it's going to be holding Soft Sand to increase ground-type moves. Next up, we have my Floatzel. Floatzel has really terrible nature. I wish I could have changed it. You know, special defense high, speed low, and he's a speedster, so that really sucks. Got Crunch, Aqua Jet, Ice Beam and waterfall next up my infernape infernape has leftovers he's a hardy nature so it's neutral we're gonna see how it works out i got u-turn flamethrower close combat and power up punch so we'll see how that goes i'm really not confident in him making it we have the lovely poison ivy which is a an amazing modest nature um i ended up taking away toxic so i'm running protect giga drain Leech Seed, and Sludge Bomb. I think this is going to be my ace in the hole. And, of course, I have to have Big Root. So I'm going to get extra from Leech Seed and Giga Drain. Um, this is going to be my ace in the hole. If, I, if she dies early, I'm in serious trouble. That being said, let's go into the Elite Four. Um, I did off-camera. I did Sunny Shore Gym, and I did Victory Road. I just really wanted to get to this point. It's time to finish this Nuzlocke series. It's been going on way too long. Gotta make it look good. Alright. And here we go. Suck to homeboy right here. Oh, shoot. Noob. What a freaking noob. I forgot about this battle. That's crazy. And this is my second time playing through this game. I totally forgot about this battle. Wow. Alright, here we go. Alright, so... Nonetheless... So I'm going to go with a similar strategy and very imperative that I set up rocks on every single opponent. So that is what we're going to do first. Set up South Rocks. We're going to see how much of a hit we can take. Now, the kicker to this, um, I know it's been a while since I've been on and streaming and especially playing this game. Just want to remind everybody that there is a God Pokemon in my Nuzlocke. That puts me in a better position, but um, still... We'll see. Um, all right. Did Rain Dance. Not sure why. I'm not sure what the play is here, but we're going to go Calm Mine. I think we'll go two Calm Mine. See if we can sweep. Might be able to. Hey, come on, man. I got my uh, Death Counter here active. I got the layout open. I'm going to be really sad if I lose people, but this point it is what it is all right i think we're okay we're gonna go psychic uh, of course you do you stupid bird yeah 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 close combat that's gonna hurt but it's gonna drop your stats that's okay with me defense fell flash cannon all right snorlax snorlax could be a problem so I feel as if I'm going to stay in. Now, if I can lower his special defense stat, I can get rid of him in two hits. Maybe one. Ah, man. I really don't want to lose the boost because I still feel like I can sweep. I mean, I can easily take out Snorlax right here. Okay. And now I'm going to fall asleep. And I'm asleep. 
Sleeping on the job, huh? Okay, Roserade. That's my guy right there. No chance. Oh, I forgot I'm asleep. I want to try to maybe naturally wake up. Oh, did you wake up? Okay. Wait. What? Oh, man. Let's say, why did she heal twice? Yes. Let's go. One hit. You're dead. Let's go. Heracross should be in the same situation. Part fighting. Good job, Starfire. You sent him out there to die. I mean, unless I miss a psychic, which I won't. So, you're dead. Damn, man, I love Heracross, man. No hard feelings, my guy. All right. Rapidash. Literally giving me a preview of the whole Elite Four. So far, I think every dude has one of these Pokemon, except for Staraptor. Uh, shit, Oko. Yeah. This is going to be a sweep. That Purple, I mean, I'm sorry, that Empoleon might give me a problem, but with my level advantage, bro, your hair flip is not cool. Ah, damn. I might have to swap out. Mm. Okay. I get healed twice. Does he get healed too? Ah, oh, man. That's going to take even longer now. All right, that's fine. What in the hell was that? Hey, you have a quick claw. You son of a nutcracker. Nothing. He can't do anything to me, so... It's just a matter of me finishing this off. I'm not worried about the moves. I can go heal up right after this. You get that double heal. Alright, good. And we're done with that. Awesome. Alright, let's heal up, regroup. And uh, let's see what we're going up against in our first... Our first Elite Four member. Larry, Larry, oh my Larry. You had a good run, buddy. Ooh, this is it. This, I feel it. The pressure's mounting. Our road to glory starts here, everybody. These guys are all beefed up. And here we go. Elite Four member, Aaron, the bug type. Welcome to the Pokemon League. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we know you're a fan of bug Pokemon. And they're beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Let's do it. Let's do this. Bam, bam, bam. Dustox. Now, Dustox doesn't pose too much of a threat to my Jirachi, aka Starfire. So I'm going to go Stealth Rock, and then I'm going to probably Calm Mine once and try to sweep. Ah, okay. Okay, that could be a little annoying. But let's go, let's go ahead and Calm Mine. There we go. Good job. Yes. Good job, Starfire. Okay. Now we should be fine to sweep, or not sweep, but at least obliterate that one. How the hell did you? So that that freaking light screen, yo. That's the only way. There's no way. All right. I'm gonna anticipate a heal, so I'm gonna actually go for a calm mine. Yes. Good job. Knew that was coming. We'll go up plus two, or I don't remember the increase in um, number as far as Calm Mind goes, but I'm going to look that up right now because I cannot remember. Increase. How many times did I do it? I did it twice. I mean, I should definitely one-shot. I should have one-shot the first time. Yeah, goodbye, Dustox. I might be able to stay in and just sweep. I'm already plus two. I don't know if that light screen wore off yet, but it should soon. Oh, nice. Now I'm plus two on everything. You really sent him in? I'm going to outspeed you. And I got the rocks to dig in. That's a one hit. Let's go. Come on. Let's beat this game, man. Let's beat this game. Let's go. All right. Beautify. Beautify might cause me some trouble. Maybe. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Dude, you just lost like half your life. We're going to go flash cannon to spread it out a little. Drapion might be an issue, but not really, because, um, I don't even think I'm, I need to worry about Drapion. And, oh, this guy. This one is going to be interesting. Oh, but you're already halfway. I got you to burn your berry, and you didn't even get an attack off yet. Isn't that unfortunate? Never faced him before. I'm going to go Psychic. Not worried at all with this one. Yeah, that's a one hit. Let's go. Drapion. Now, Drapion has Earthquake. Could be a problem if I let him set up. Without letting him set up, I don't really see too much of an issue with two Flash Cannons. Oh. 
Oh, man. Woo. First of all, first of all, how did a slow ass, molasses moving ass, Drapion just outspeed my amazing 10 levels higher Starfire? You lost. It don't matter. What up? They trying to kill me. That was crazy. All right, let's heal up. All right, on to number two. Bertha is the ground type trainer. So this one, this one is risky. This is very risky. So I'm going to start, I'm actually going to start out with Poison Ivy. Poison Ivy is going to be my lead. Um, hopefully can just run through all of them. Strategically, of course. Um, and then if I run into a bad situation, I got to send in Jirachi. I mean, you know what? Here we go. Come on, Bertha. The ground type elite four member elite four member man my hair is looking freaking crazy bro here we go now i wanted to set up stealth rocks um in order to take away sturdy from the golem but at the risk of getting obliterated by an earthquake i elected not to do that could i still do that and as a switch in yes let's see how this first one goes um quagsire is times four weak to uh to grass so i think i'm gonna go straight for the giga drain and it should oko yeah all right cool now they're not all gonna be like that thinking if i do leech seed protect and then giga drain i should be able to kill that golem wish cash the wish cash is tricky because wish cash is not ah uh, wish cash is a really tricky one it wasn't supposed to be used yet yeah, because Wishcash has Ice Beam and Bulldoze. Mm. Here's the question. Can I take one Ice Beam? Can I take one Bulldoze? It, neither one of the, well, Bulldoze would be Stab. What is it holding? It is holding a Rindo Berry, and it's a modest nature. Son of a Nutcracker. This berry... It weakens the foe's super effective grass move. So that could be a problem because the electric move will not electric move will not do anything against it. I think it's zero. It resists electric. I believe it's zero. Which I don't have electric anyways. Twelve levels higher. And I definitely outspeed. Let's do it. Leech seed. Okay. We set up leech seed. That's part one. Part two, take an ice beam. It went bulldoze. Okay. Yes. Okay, okay, that's that's perfect. Now, I'm back to the same boat. One Giga Drain should kill if I outspeed. Let's see. That Pledge Leech Seed. Yes! All right. Ooh, that was that worried me. Damn. Okay, now we're back to full health. Let's go. That berry could have made a huge difference. Thank God it didn't. I could also go Gengar. Gengar has Giga Drain. All right, Mr. Studo Udo, if that's your real name. Head Smash, Sucker Punch, Low Kick. I don't think I have an issue just going Giga Drain. Yeah. Okay. All right. And now we have Golem and Hippopodon. Golem should be fine. Hippopodon is going to be a problem. All right, Golem. Now, Golem has Sturdy. So let's go Leech Seed. No way. Oh, come on. Leech Seed, I need you. Oh, man. Do I survive? Do I survive a hit? That takes away Sturdy. Oh, man, chat. Do I survive one more Earthquake? Here's what I do. I heal, right? I heal up. Leech Seed takes away a little more health. I can't go Gengar. Gengar doesn't have Levitate. If my Gengar had Levitate, I would definitely do that. How much do I trust you? Wait a minute. This is what I can do. I'll Protect. I go Protect, get some more damage from Leech Seed, which will give me more health, which will almost guarantee that I can take one more hit without burning a turn. Yes. Beautiful. I can definitely live one more Earthquake. Giga Drain. Yes! Let's go! Oh, that's even better. Let's freaking go. Let's go, Rose Raid. Let's go, Poison Ivy. I knew you, man. I knew it, bro. You got me. Come on. You got me. Let's go. All right. Now, Hippopodon is a big problem. Hippopodon has Ice Fang, Earthquake, and a Chesto Berry. And it's Adamant Nature. So both are going to hit hard. No! No, 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 no. I didn't want to. Oh, my God. No, I didn't want to do that. Okay, wait. Never mind. Holy Jesus. Yo, I left the freaking controller in my lap and accidentally did that. But it's okay. We did it. We won. Bertha, good match. You had me sweating. You had me sweating, Bertha. Wow, what an ending. Thank you, everybody, for sticking around and watching the whole episode there. That's crazy. I feel like we might have lost it at the end there, but we didn't. We pulled through and beat Bertha, and we beat Aaron, and we beat our rival all in the same episode. 
So make sure to come on back for part two. We're going to be facing off against Lucian and Flint. Those, of course, are the next two Elite Four members. Come on back for the finale after that in part three. Well, assuming we make it that far. But in the meantime, make sure you follow, like, comment, and of course, subscribe to the channel. And Pete the Sneak out.